I can't believe he spilled his beans like that. Even I thought he went overboard with it. So, then do you think that host had his desire taken by Alice? Like, what kind of professional host would do that on live TV? True. He didn't seem like he was in his right frame of mind. Like he wasn't even there and someone else was controlling him. Morgana, that's it! I don't know if all this is right, but his personality changed like when someone's heart was stolen. After the treasure? Maybe Alice can control anyone whose desire she steals. If the desire is turned over to the ruler, they wind up under their control. Like with Alice. I see. That would really explain it. Amazing as always, Lady On. But that would mean... Yeah, looks like it. <laughs> Alice said she wants to be a ray of light for people. That's what I've always wanted, too. I read about her in a magazine once, and I just really felt where she was coming from. It's why I asked to come to the show in the first place. I wanted to see her in person. But now, I wonder if that was all just... Lady on. <laughs> Man, that was great. That was... Alice? Quick, hide! Miss Alice, this is a public hall. Please, you must keep your voice down. Eh, uh, it's fine. See? No one in sight. <laughs> anyway, though, did you see that lady's face? She totally lost it up there. All those cushy, talking head types make the best faces when things finally stop going their way. Miss Alice, do you think you could stop doing these things? Huh? What do you mean? I was the victim on stage. <laughs> what is it that you want me to stop doing? I... I don't know how you're doing it, or why, but... After seeing that, there has to be something. You... Oh! So you want me to punish you again? Ah, please! I'm sorry! Oh, oops! What a terrible accident! Just like what happened on set, a terrible accident. I'm still upset over it too, you know. Isn't it your job to take my side? Or are you asking to end up broken like my last manager? Do you want to get stuck up in your room like he is? Ugh. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. I don't want toys that don't do as they're told. Stop! Then beg me to forgive you until it hurts as much as you hurt me with your words. Why don't you do what you did yesterday? Grovel with your face all messed up with snot. I'll take another video if you like. Come on, then. Do it! Do it! I'm not gonna stop until you do, got it? <sighs> hey, the guy sounds like he's in real pain. If she doesn't cut it out... Hey, stop! Uh, and who is this? Way too far! You said you wanted to be a ray of light for people! How the hell does that help? Uh. Oh! <laughs> we were just playing around! Weren't we? Yeah. So you'll go get the car now? Oh! Hey! Wait! Hang on! Uh are you on Takamaki? Uh, you know who I am? Yeah! I know all the models. I read every fashion magazine the day it comes out. Actually, I really admire you. Would you like to be friends? <laughs> you obviously got Emma, right? <laughs> My keyword is... Don't bother. I'd never accept someone who treats another person like that. Aw, too bad. But 
but I do appreciate honesty. So, how about you? Would you like to be friends? Like I said, we were just playing around. Hey, hang on. You were at 705 the other day, weren't you? We're done here. Let's go. Ah, <sighs> that's a bummer. But I know I gave him one of my cards. Why doesn't he obey? And then I stormed out and we came back here. Sorry about that, by the way. I was just so upset. No apology needed. You did a fantastic job finding out about Alice. Yeah, it's all thanks to you, Lady Anne. Once Lady Anne had her on the ropes, she whipped out her phone and tried adding them all on Emma right away. From what we saw, she might know that she can use Emma to lure people into her jail. She gets them into her jail, then takes their desires so they'll do what she says. I suspect she's been doing this for a while now. I see. That does explain things. But what is her end goal? I can't imagine such awful behavior actually doing her any good. Ain't it the same as with Kamoshida? That's a good point. She seemed to be having a blast being such an awful person. Whatever it is, she has the gall to set up that kind of tragedy on live TV. She isn't in her right mind anymore. The longer we leave this be, the more victims that pile up. And it's already gotten to be quite a pile. Now's the time to act. But just how should we act? Is there a treasure in her jail? That's the tricky part. I am picking up a faint scent of something treasure-like, but... What is a treasure? It's the condensed core of a ruler's desires. That's what gives birth to a palace and powers it. Usually we just take the treasure to trigger a change of heart in our target. Hmm, that's interesting. What if there is no treasure there? We can't change Alice's heart. For now, let's focus on tracking the treasure-like scent Morgana mentioned. That should at least put us on the trail for clues. Question. Why must we change Alice's heart? Why? Because she's hurting people. So Alice only needs to be stopped. Changing her heart is unnecessary. No. Beating her shadow won't help. Worst case scenario, it could wind up causing her to die in the real world. Death. Is an acceptable outcome. Dude, that's. I'm humanity's companion. I'm supposed to determine the best choices for humanity. Alice Hiraki makes people suffer every day. We should ensure she stops this as soon as possible. Why not do so? I do not understand. I want to understand, but I cannot. Where is the flaw in my logic? I do see where you're coming from, Sophia. Alice is doing horrible things. We could just help all those people without caring what happens to her. The metaverse is serious. You can end a life without ever being endangered. Even still, we always choose to change someone's heart instead of harming them. It's part of the Phantom Thieves Code. That's right. Kinda pointless if we gotta stoop to the bad guy's level to take him down. We never kill. We steal the desires of the wicked and make them change their ways. Mm-hmm. That's why we're the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Phantom Thieves of Hearts. I've got it. Hearts. I lack a heart. That's why I don't understand the logic of the Phantom Thieves. If only I could understand how hearts work. If I did that, I could become an even better companion. Sophia? I've got it. I will join the Phantom Thieves. I need to learn more about hearts so I can become an even better companion. May I join the Phantom Thieves? If I do so, I am certain I will witness many things about the human heart. I need to learn more about the heart and about the Phantom Thieves. Thank you. Thank you for joining, Sophia. Welcome to the Phantom Thieves. Glad to have you with us. Let's pick our code name next. Ooh, now the nostalgia's flowing. That's basically her name. I love.
like it. You do? I want to be Sophie. Then you'll be Sophia in this world and Sophie in the metaverse. Radical, dude. <laughs> Jeez, you're already more human-like than when we first met you. I am constantly learning things, thanks to the internet. I'm learning more words as I speak. Don't pick up any off-putting lingo, okay? Okay, so we got a new member. Now we need to come up with our first mission. Good. This feels like our duty, considering we became phantom thieves to help anyone suffering. I was one of those people once. We may not know the victims personally, but it would reflect on us poorly as phantom thieves to not lend a helping hand. As long as there are people in trouble out there, we won't turn our backs on them. You're right. We are going to be the ray of light for everyone. That even includes Alice. I have registered myself as a phantom thief. All right, the phantom thieves are back in action. step is to make the proper preparations. It's a fact that provision is prevention. We'll all need weapons and other supplies. Since you're the guy with all the connections, we'll leave the shopping to you like always. We'll get ourselves ready. Once you are too, just hit us up. Hey. Welcome to the Velvet Room. The gears of fate turn yet again, bringing you close to calamity once more. While your hope may be the smallest of seeds now, and its true power unknown, by nurturing the possibilities within you, this seed shall sprout and become your strength against calamity. Now, I shall act in my master's stead, and watch over you through your journey. Yes, I share the sentiment. As you already know, by offering up your personas for execution, this is once due to my master's absence, unfortunately. This means you will be unable to harness the power of personas you once harbored within you. However, this journey... <laughs> Trickster. You have unleashed the chains that by doing so will surely... As long as your will is undeterred with that address, fuse two per... Please select the persona. 
It seems that it can gain new power. Choose which... Is this the... Be born anew. You've tapped into... You wish to strengthen it? How much power will you add? This is what you... Okay. Whenever you feel the need for more, I will always be by your... Really? Let's head back. Soft shops closed. Takemi Clinic's shut down for summer vacation. Where are we gonna get our weapons and medicine now? Talk about shitty timing. This is not good. We can't just return to the Metaverse defenseless. I guess we gotta find some other stores. And that seems like it'll take quite some time. What's up? Have a problem? Perhaps I can help. If you would like, I'm happy to lend a hand. Oh, yeah. Check this out, Sophia. We need supplies to take with us into the jail. Unfortunately, our usual suppliers are closed. Do you know if there are any suitable stores nearby? Why not just order supplies online? We could do that, but the delay between ordering and actually getting the stuff is way too long. Also, we were able to get much more effective medicines from our clinic than we could find online. No prob. The net has it all. Ryuji, is there something you want? Huh? Right. Request anything you want. Uh, okay. <sighs> Don't be ridiculous. Ah, come on, it was just a joke. Nothing else popped into my head when she asked, so... Okay, I've got it. Please wait. Hmm? Got what? Hello? Expedited delivery! Uh, uh, did you really order a gold bar? Uh, whoa. <laughs> well, some. UG, this is. What? Me? That'll be fine! Shit, this is probably just gonna be fake or <laughs> some toy. <laughs> is that real? Holy shit! Yes, my eyes can't be fooled. There's no doubt. That's real gold. No way. No way is that real. Wow! Now I can open my cafe early. Th that needs to go to the police. Right away. Oh, wait. They even believe it showed up like this? Is this a crime? It's okay, everybody. 
All right. Did that solve your problem? I found an online vendor with expedited delivery. Time is no longer a concern. But a whole gold bar? Where'd you find that? The dark web? Correct, Futaba. It's fine. I broke no laws. The transaction was made with cryptocurrency. I will send you an invoice for reimbursement. We have to reimburse you? So, uh... At least a few million. Send it back. Sorry? I... Send the other thing back! Hello? Expedited pickup! Thank you for choosing our services! I'm relieved they took it back, but... <sighs> that definitely gave us some gray hairs. Jeez. Oh, come on! Who would have thought a gold bar would actually show up here? I've heard of one's mouth writing checks that cannot be cashed, but this is an entirely new level. Doesn't the service itself seem pretty awesome, though? That speed, it'll be perfect for anything we need. Shall I do that? Okay. I'll make sure to use expedited delivery. Sophia's shop is officially open. Well, that was a ride. But I guess it turned out okay for us? Yeah, our supply situation's definitely fine now. We don't know what we'll be up against in the jail, though. Our first goal would be the treasure room, yes? I'm sensing something treasure-like over here. That way. Towards 705. That's where you were taken when they captured you, right? Yeah. Just thinking about it pisses me off. Piece of shit so full of herself. So, Alice is there now, huh? You know, it does sort of look like a castle. A castle ruled by a monarch. I admit, it's rather fitting. So? We're heading to the castle? Yeah, that sounds good. This jail is crawling with shadows. Watch your backs out there. Okay, I'll watch your backs out there. <laughs> Sophie's inaugural heist is a phantom thief. This'll be great. We don't know the opposition will face. Be sure to switch out team members when necessary. Good point. We're at your beck and call, Joker.
I'll just add this. numbers. Don't you remember what to do at times like this? Watch for an opening, then jump it from behind. Be careful not to get spotted. Show me your true self. Some time. They'll go a lot smoother than the other. I guess now we just push forward.
shadow over there. Watch your step. Sorry for them. Let's keep up the pace, shall we? Huh. 